Anishio Side Effect, one of the most popular niche spicy fragrances out there. Pretty pricey too. Some good stuff. It's worth the money. But what if you don't want to spend that kind of money? What if I told you you could get a fragrance that's extremely similar for a fraction of the cost? Well, today we're talking about that fragrance from Sammy Andrews Fragrances. Newest release called Purple Sapphire. Stay tuned. So I've been giving this one a whirl lately and uh, it lives up to being a part of the Sapphire collection because those of you that have been watching the channel for a while, you know my two favorite fragrances from Sammy, Blue Sapphire and Red Sapphire. And now we have Purple Sapphire. No breakdown, no need to put it on the screen because it's right here on the bottle. Cinnamon rum, tobacco, sandalwood and vanilla. Extract to parfum concentration. It's only been out for about two weeks or so. It's a very new fragrance in his collection. He has about 24 fragrances roughly. I, have, I forgot to count them before the video. He's got a lot to offer. A lot of really good hidden gem stuff. And I got to tell you, if you like Anishio Side Effect, if you've had a sample or have a friend that has a bottle or anything or just tried it and you know you like it, you want a bottle, but you don't want to spend that kind of money, this might be the answer for you. Because in the top, you're definitely going to get plenty of that cinnamon spice. On the test strip, when I when I first sprayed it the other day on my first impressions, I wasn't getting a lot of cinnamon. But on skin, when I wore it, I definitely got a lot of the cinnamon. The rum, the tobacco is a nice supporting player in this one. It's not in your face. The cinnamon's a bit more in your face with the rum. And then the sandalwood and vanilla do come out more as the transition and dry down start to commence and this fragrance settles down more and more. The cinnamon starts to fade over time, as does the rum where the vanilla and the sandalwood really start to come up. Now the vanilla in this one, I don't know any of you that have tried this, but it gets quite powdery on my skin in the deep dry down. It's kind of a powdery vanilla versus a creamy vanilla. It starts off creamy and spicy up top because of the sandalwood and the vanilla, but as you get deeper into the dry down, at least on my skin, it gets a little bit powdery. So it is a little bit different from Anishio side effect because I find this a little bit creamier and a little bit more powdery than Anishio side effect tends to be. This is not a direct clone. This is definitely inspired by in Sammy's version of it. He wasn't going for a direct clone clearly based on how this one smells compared to the original. And in performance, it's stellar. It's 10 to 12 hours. I got a little over 10 hours before it really became a skin scent. And then the projection is actually quite heavy on this one. It doesn't fill a room, but it's kind of in that sweet spot, maybe a little bit louder than that sweet spot where, you know, five or six feet out, people are going to smell you easily. If they're downwind from you or in a well circulated room, they'll really be able to smell you from several feet out for the first three or four hours. Projection is very steady for the first several hours, not just the first few. And then it does have a mild scent trail after about the four hour mark where it's still relatively easy to smell you when you walk by somebody. Performance is great on this one. Actually one of the better performers of his newest releases um, and one of the better smelling fragrances of his new releases. In my opinion on this final thought, Purple Sapphire from Sammy Andrews Fragrances is a must buy, not just a must try. I do love a good spicy fragrance. I've always loved the way Anishio Side Effect smells. I could never just pull the trigger. I always procrastinate getting it. And now that I have Purple Sapphire, I don't have a need to because it's that good in my opinion. It really is. This is one of the best fragrances Sammy has put out. It does the Sapphire Collection justice because Blue Sapphire is great, Red Sapphire is great, and Purple Sapphire, ladies and gentlemen, this is great. Kudos, Sammy. Let me put this down. Give you a little hand. You did a fantastic job on this, sir. I'm super happy to have this. And guys, if you're looking for a good spicy fragrance for the holiday season, you don't want to spend a lot of money. I'm telling you, Purple Sapphire from Sammy Andrews Fragrances, this is a must buy. And until next time, do me a real quick favor. Go ahead and like, comment, subscribe. Do appreciate all the feedback. I love hearing from you guys. How many of you have tried this already? I know several people in my first impressions video had already got it and they were letting me know how they felt about it. And it seems like that's the consensus on how this thing's great. You know, that seems to be what everybody's saying. And now that I've got to spend some time with it and experience it, yeah, it's a great fragrance. And until next time, I will say, if you get your hands on Purple Sapphire and you give it a spray now, definitely confident that you'll thank me later. This is some good stuff. Have a good one, guys.